With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone, a string in wood wood around a hollow cylinder of mass 5 kg and radius 0.5 meter. If the string is now pulled with a horizontal force of 40 newton, you can see in the diagram, the cylinder is rolling without slipping on, on a horizontal surface, then angular acceleration of the cylinder will be. You have to find out the angular acceleration. So what will happen? This is a hollow cylinder, right? And it is given that if the uh, if the string is pulled, the cylinder rotates with uh, without slipping, roll without slipping. So what will happen if I take this point A and this point B? So the point A and point B will have same acceleration since it is performing pure rolling, right? So let's suppose the alpha is in this direction. An acceleration of this is A, right? So, if I talk about the net acceleration of A, that will be A minus alpha R. Because of the translation, it will gain a acceleration in this direction A. And because of the rotational motion, it will gain a alpha R acceleration in this direction. So, the acceleration of point A will be A minus alpha R. And that will be equals to acceleration of B which is 0. So from here you will get alpha R equals to A. Very simple. Now it is given that a force is applied like this. Right. So you have to find out the alpha. So let us write down. Let us first draw the FBD. So if the F force is acting here. And the force is having a magnitude of 40 Newton. Right. And this force is acting in opposite direction, friction force. And uh, the center is having an acceleration of A in this direction. And ang angular acceleration is this, right? So if I write the torque equation and force equation. So first of all, let's write the force equation. I will write F minus small f is equals to mass times acceleration. So if you see in the question, 5 kg is the ma 5 kg mass is given. So I will put... Uh, m equals to 5 in the equation further right and if i uh, write the torque equation you could see the capital f and small m both are producing the torque in same direction so i will write f into r plus f into r is equals to m r square since the cylinder is hollow if you see in is it, is, it is given that it is a hollow cylinder m r square into alpha right so this will be the expression for the torque, right? So I will write here, this is the torque that is equal to I alpha, right? And this is what? I alpha. So this R will get cancelled out. And alpha R is equal to A. So I will write F plus F is equal to M. Very simple. So if you solve, if you add the two equation, you will get to know the friction force here is zero. This is equation 1 and this is equation 2. So if you will add the two equation, equation 1 plus equation 2 or you can also do one thing. You can subtract the two equation, right? Then also you will get to know the friction uh, F force is 0 and capital F will be equal to MA. Right? Once uh, you can add and once you can subtract and you will get these two results, right? Now we have the uh, value of F. Right. Uh, so just put uh, put the value of F in uh, this expression. Right. Like we know that alpha R is equals to A. Right. And if you've seen the question, force is given and R is given. Right. And mass is also given. So from here, just uh, note down the value of A. A is this. F by M. And now alpha is equals to A by R. So it will be F by MR. Just put the values now. F is 40 Newton. Right. M is 5 kg. And radius is 0.5. Just put the value. 40, 5 kg. And radius is 5 by 10. Right. So it will be 2 
and uh, this will be um, 8 and it is equals to 16 radian per second square and this will be the angular acceleration and uh, you can see B option is 6 rate 16 radian per second square this will be the answer thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today